Hello, my name is Dirk Kolbe and I have the pleasure to introduce you to the vision examination for examination, inspection and test personnel. I have invented this in order to document the qualification of personnel. Personnel for visual examination of welds in plant engineering for example, for evaluation of radiographic records, for surface crack uh, examination by either magne magnetic particle or liquid penetrant method. Now, uh, the personal qualification is based on these international standards, either SNTTC 1A, uh, CP 189 or ISO 9712, which is uh, in force since the year 2012. And all of these standards require that, first of all, the near distance acuity of the personnel must be demonstrated and must be proven uh, at least with a Jaeger number two or in other codes a Jaeger number one is required and also the distinguishing and differentiating of colors, contrasts of colors and also shades of gray. Now, uh, in order to accommodate that, uh, the Jaeger chart has been used, uh, has been invented by famous uh, Austrian optometrist uh, Dr. Jaeger, uh, Ritter von Jagstahl, who was in, uh, working in Vienna in the 19th century. Uh, for the color differentiation, very often the Ishihara charts are used. However, Ishihara charts have been invented by Dr. Ishihara, a Japanese optometrist in the 20th century. Uh, they are good for distinguishing whether or not somebody is colorblind or red-green deficient. The examination colors are not necessarily introduced and therefore I have decided to, uh, to invent this vision examination. If you open it, you will find first of all a brief introduction how to use then the Jaeger 1 and Jaeger 2 charts, those ones that we need for, for industrial use and the colors used in the various methods, the colors and shades of grey with their combinations which you can choose. Now, uh, I would like to show you how to use this uh, and how to document the results in this wonderful form which is being attached to the examination as well. First of all, make sure you consider the written practice and the quality program requirements. Then the examiner who conducts the vision exam should select the required test, text size and also the required colors applicable to the methods which are to be used in the qualification of the personnel. Make sure you have adequate working light conditions and watch the distance 30 to 50 centimeters. Uh, that's uh, the distance that should be kept for um, American users one foot or to one foot and a half. That's uh, approximately what you should follow. Make sure that these examination results are not considered as medical examination results, it's simply a physical property which has been documented. Uh, we have the Jaeger 1, Jaeger 2 charts in uh, three different languages and uh, it's important that you first choose the required chart. Is it Jaeger 1, like for ASME section 3 required, or section 8 uh, ASME code Jaeger 2, which is, uh, which is necessary to be distinguished. Then with respect to the shades of grey and colors tables, select the required colors for your method of NDE. For PT, you need red, white, grey, uh, and that's certainly sufficient. So you will be happy with this corner of the of the sheet, and you don't need the rest. Uh, for MT, uh, fluorescent MT, for example, green comes into play. For radiographic examination, you only need shades of grey, and the the other. Uh, plentiful colors here are not necessarily to be considered. Now, again, distance 30 to 50 centimeters should be followed. This is how an examination could look like or an examination result. Uh, Ms. Mustermann, she was kind enough to conduct uh, this examination. Uh, the employer can stamp its company stamp here. Uh, she has passed Jaeger 1 and Jaeger 2. She has uh, distinguished all colors correctly and therefore the test is passed. Another example. 
Jerry Cotton. He wasn't as successful. First of all, he passed only Jaeger 2, which is nicely documented here. And then with respect to the color results, we come to the conclusion that VT, MT and PT are limited and therefore not uh, recommended as examination methods. For radiographic examination, we have absolutely no limitations. All shades of gray were distinguished correctly. The test is passed, but the limitations are indicated. So this is how we think the form should be used. We wish you a lot of success in the use and uh, certainly you can purchase the examination from our homepage uh, and contact me on the, um, on the discussion forum that we have or via telephone when necessary. Thanks very much. Have a good day. Bye.